Hello guys and girls, here is my demon hunter. Uh, I hope it will help you get something straight up. It's just for speed farming and I use it to boost people fast and efficient. So what do we want to check out? We want to check out some of the gear, how it works and if you can use it yourself. We're going with the Dawn. We're going with Mandal of Channeling. We're going with Royal Ring of Grandeur. So what is the rest of the gear and why? Okay, we have this weapon because we want as much multi-shot as we can get and therefore also the offhand. Multi-shot, multi-shot. On this build you can go for a lot of area damage if you want as you spread fire all over the place. So uh, what's it's important when you run with on... Uh, what is it called again? I forget that all the time. On Hollowed Essence. If you read the last one, it says you generate a multi-shot and then Gazer deal 350% increased damage for every point of discipline you have. Okay, that sounds pretty good. So where can you have discipline? It says here secondary, 12, maximum discipline. Okay, that's pretty good. We can also get it on the chest and we can get it on the offhand. So we want it on these three items. It needs to be 12% to get the maximum damage. You also need quite a lot of cooldown. So where you can get is in shoulders, you can get in rings, and you can get it on an offhand, a main hand if you need. Um, you can also get it on a necklace, but I wouldn't do that. And of course your headpiece. If you can just keep up your engaging, you have enough. There is other guides where people have a specific number. I don't, I just clean up my own shit. So I use uh, Gym of Ease on myself because it's when I kill monsters, other get the bonus. So that can go really fast when you clear Thomas 16 as I do. Also go with Seekirk, go with the uh, Bane of the Strigeon and also with um, Set Stone of Vengeza. The most important one I think is the Set Stone of Vengeza because you just deal a lot of damage when you're away from them and you fly through everything so it's an easy killer. Just go with some green gems, as you just do Tormund 16, key farming, bounty, stuff like that. Um, if you do bounties and you don't boost people, you can choose to have a green one in your weapon to deal even more damage. Else you go with focus and restraints and can uh, Captain Chrism. It doesn't care that you have armor, but if you can go for more all resist, it's good, because we don't have that much as a dexterity user. Um, so, cooldown. Multi-shot as high as possible because it's percentage, so you really want it as close to 200 as possible. Uh, so that is kind of the bell. Let's go over the skills. Okay, it goes like this. You only need to hit one time with multi-shot. You just need to use it once, and every time you spin, then it will actually shoot out all the time because of what we get from the... Uh, what is it called again? Sorry for that. Um, Angelic Crucible. What you want to have here is Straff now cast the last non challenge Hatred Spender. So that will be the multi-shot for free. So that's why we only need to cast it once. Then you use Straff the whole time. Just do this. Whoop, 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 and then it casts multi-shot when there is some mobs around you. Easy peasy. Then you want this up as all time because it reduces the damage taken. You can also choose here when you're just doing this. Just go with increased hatred generation because it doesn't really care if you die. You're on soft core. So you have smoke screen. Uh, this is going to increase your movement. So see, it makes you even faster. So you want to have displacement here. Then we have grenade. I use it on number three here so I can just cast it. In It's increasing of the hatred. So it's kind of nice to have. Then you have focus preparing. It just keep up your discipline so you can keep up using smoke screen. Then we have blood vengeza. You have hot pursuit, tactical advantages, and cold of the week. So that's it, guys. That's how it works. Right click, keep things up, go around, kill everything. It's going to be easy for you. Best of luck out there. I'll see you next time.